हमारे साथ में मैडम है प्रोफेसर शिल्पा गौर जी मैडम नमस्ते मैम नमस्ते सर गुड मॉर्निंग एवरीबॉडी एंड थैंक्स फॉर जॉइनिंग मैम है आपके सॉफ्ट स्किल ट्रेनर के लिए हैं मैम आर आई एम अरिहंत ग्रुप ऑफ इंस्टीट्यूट पुणे महाराष्ट्र में ऐसे देखो मैम शी हैज बीन कंडक्टिंग मोटिवेशनल एज वेल एज बिहेवियर ट्रेनिंग एट बी स्कूल इन कॉरपोरेट्स टुडे शी इज हियर टू स्पीक ऑन सॉफ्ट स्किल्स व्हिच हेल्प्स टू अटेन सक्सेस विदाउट एनी डिले आई हैंड ओवर द स्क्रीन टू मैडम शिल्पा मैम प्लीज Thank you, madam, to valuable time. Thank you so much. Uh, what's your name, sir? Rahul, sir. Okay. Rahul. Thank Parina. you, Rahul, sir, for giving me uh, this such a brief introduction, and uh, it's my privilege to be here. And I would also like to thank uh, Dr. Subhash Sharma for inviting me for this webinar. And I'm glad and excited to interact your students. So uh, basically, uh, I also want to add one point here in my introduction that I hail from Je uh, Jaipur only. I am also from Rajasthan. So I'm telling this thing to your students because you know I really want so that they can connect well with me that I am also from Rajasthan. So this is the only thing. So let's begin and uh, right. Okay. Just give me one second. I'm going to share my screen. I'm going to show one PPT to your students. uh can you all see my screen yes ma'am okay all right okay so uh let's begin with this so for the next 45 to 40 minutes i'm going to speak on turning weakness into strength and uh, soft skills are key to success so basically uh Uh, first of all it is really very important to know what are soft skills soft skills hote kya hai aur hum kaise in pe work kar sakte hain and how we can begin it so soft skills are interpersonal skills which are used to describe your approach towards life your work your relationship with other people how you talk with people kis tarah se aap baat karte hain kis tarah se aap present karte hain apne aap ko that comes under soft skills so as you say, as you can see that soft skills you know the word is soft that means you should be more polite in speaking uh you should be more humble whenever you talk to anybody so you know soft skills are those skills which you actually learn by experience okay so uh, this is all about interpersonal skills and soft skills could be your selling point so um, uh, if you know i, I have no idea these are mba students uh rahul sir am i audible no ma'am am i audible yes, yes ma'am you are audible we are not mba students we are law mm -hmm. students okay law students okay i just uh, wanted to confirm that so that i can give you examples like that only so basically you know in law and uh, you know i taught law students as well so uh, you know if you you will become lawyer in future right so basically you know that you know if you want to win a case or if you want to you know just want to be a winner in every case that means you should have good soft skills you should have that convincing power so that you can win the case for your you know for, for whom you are fighting that case so basically that could become your unique selling point 
and soft skills is utterly important for every individual to sustain and grow in daily life also right aap daily life mein aap jis tarah se baat karte ho deal karte ho that really matters a lot it also talks about how a person reacts and interacts in workplace and in life how effectively he deals with his manager co-worker subordinates and other general just imagine you're working somewhere and uh, you uh, you want to impress your boss or you know it's not like that you are doing something intentionally aap aisa kuch nahi karenge kuch activity jisse aap impression pade aapka samne wale pe but definitely you will do something like that that it indirectly affects your image that means aap agar acche se baat karte ho kisi se it definitely going to add one brownie point in your profile right so it is really very important that how you react publicly at workplace or even at your home also suppose you have some function at your place and ghar pe function hai sab log aaye hue hai right and you have other cousins also at your place right so your cousins are behaving in different way but you are very sophisticated and good in talking so definitely your relatives will say that you know this this uh, uh, you know kid or children are very your children are very Uh, good in speaking right so according to a uh, research conducted in harvard stanford university only 15% of your career success is provided by your hard skills so uh, we will definitely discuss in detail what are hard skills okay and 85% you know skills are depend completely on soft skills that your personal relations with people how you behave like that okay now there is uh, another point which i have written for you that is skills to pay your bills so i am going to elaborate this point for you so if you are good enough and if you have that convincing power for uh, you know anything you can do anything you can go get good job you can get anything okay i'll give you an example aap interview dene gaye hain aur interview de rahe hain aap aur इंटरव्यू देते वक्त आपके साथ में एक बंदा ऐसा बैठा है जिसकी थ्रू आउट नाइनटीज और एटीज परसेंटेज है बट एट द वेरी मोमेंट ऑफ टाइम व्हेन यू सी योर प्रोफाइल एंड योर रेज्यूमे यू कैन सी दैट यू आर नॉट दैट गुड इन मार्क्स यू यू हार्डली एवरेज स्टूडेंट बट यू नो इफ यू हैव प्रैक्टिकल नॉलेज इफ यू हैव गुड सॉफ्ट स्किल्स दैट मीन्स यू विल गेट सिलेक्टेड सो मार्क्स matters because you know obviously it reflects your resume in a positive way but at the very moment of time if you don't have practical knowledge if you are nervous during interview you won't get that job so basically you know you can go through with that interview but if you really want job you should have that convincing power you should have that good soft skill so that you can impress interviewers and you can get the job very easily easily okay so this is all about this and understand communication is you know many people think and in fact most of the students think that you know oh my god you know soft skills means english no first of all you have to understand that how you can communicate okay communication is important and communication you know can be or could be in any language in which you are comfortable so first of all aap is cheez se familiar hoiye ki aap communicate to kare at least आपने देखा होगा आप ही की क्लास में कुछ बच्चे ऐसे होते हैं जो बिल्कुल चुप रहते हैं क्लास में वो बिल्कुल कुछ नहीं बोलते हैं बट सम स्टूडेंट आर वेरी वेरी क्यूरियस टू नो ईच एंड एवरीथिंग दे ऑलवेज आस्क क्वेश्चंस इन द क्लास टू प्रोफेसर राइट सो दिस गिव्स एन इंप्रेशन एंड प्रोफेसर को भी लगता है कि नहीं ये बच्चा है ये शाय नहीं है एटलीस्ट ही और शी कम्युनिकेट समथिंग अगर आपको कुछ समझ में नहीं आ रहा है तो आप पूछते रहो एटलीस्ट दैट मीन्स यू आर कम्युनिकेटिंग दिस थिंग to your professor and that you are also at the very moment of time communicating that you are not shy that means you have good communication skills right so basically you have to understand the difference between communication and language so communication is an art which you have to you know build in yourself and you have to learn that art and at the very moment of time english is a language that you have to learn separately so both goes parallel so you have to learn english language separately and then you have to merge it if you want to communicate you can communicate in english language okay and uh, how so social so, sorry uh, soft skills work so it builds positive relationships and makes socialize well with others 
आप कम बात करते हो राइट right? आप कम बात करते हो तो लोगों को लगता है ठीक है कम बात करते हैं लेट्स टॉक टू दैट पर्सन हु टॉक वेल राइट आप जस्ट इमेजिन यू आर सब आई गिव यू एन एग्जाम्पल आपको कोई प्रोफेसर पढ़ाने आए हैं राइट right? और वो प्रोफेसर पढ़ाने आए तो अगर आपके प्रोफेसर सिर्फ आपको बुक रीड करके बस आपको एक एक लाइन समझाएं राइट एंड देन जस्ट द पर्स प्रोफेसर इज गोइंग टू लीव द क्लास एंड एट द वेरी मोमेंट आई अ प्रोफेसर हु इज गोइंग टू गिव यू लाइव एग्जांपल्स हु टेक्स यू आउट फॉर सम एजुकेशनल ट्रिप्स और लाइक दैट दैट गिव्स अ यू नो ग्रेट इंप्रेशन दैट मींस द पर्सन इज मेकिंग यू सोशलाइज द पर्सन इज गिविंग यू प्रैक्टिकल एग्जांपल्स so it builds a positive relationship and make socialize you well right so uh, now types of skills as i had discussed earlier that there are uh, two types of skill that is hard skills that uh, that includes your degrees your knowledge your trainings whatever trainings you had uh, in the past your specialization in any subject your uh, specialization training or work experience or any anything which you had in past and that you are going to put in uh, your cv or resume right so this can be your hard skills can be developed through learning through experience through, through some trainings so these skills are important to be stated in your resume you you need something to write in your resume right so abhi aapko kuch to likhna hoga resume so these hard skills comes under that but soft skills soft skills are about your emotional so everything goes around emotional portion also so basically if you are emotionally weak right suppose uh, i'll give you an example uh, just imagine you have started working with some uh, law firm okay as you are law student so i'm going to give you law examples so aap kisi law firm mein kaam kar rahe hain right and uh, you are very uh, you get annoyed on very small small things choti choti baat pe aapko gussa ho jata hai ya ya fir aap nervous dikhte ho ya kuch bhi anything like that that gives a negative impression right so soft skills are about and how how you can do this i mean uh, agar ghar pe aap kisi se fight karke aaye ho suppose you had a fight with your brother sister or with your uh, parents that you know i don't want to eat this thing mom what you have prepared in you know for the breakfast like that so that reflects uh, in your workplace also so just remember this thing apne aap ko emotionally bahut strong banana zaruri hai agar aap emotionally weak ho that is definitely going to affect your uh, workplace and your uh, student life also right so this is really very important to balance your emotions because nobody can stay without emotion so i am not saying ki aap emotion hata do aur emotion hata ke apna kaam karo work karo soft skill pe no emotions are always going to be there because we are human beings right so how you communicate with other people socially that really matters so just balance things aapko kab kya emotion dikhana hai kiske samne ye aapko pata hona chahiye right so relationship with others also matters and soft skills is your usp which makes you different from other right suppose what do you think aapke professors hote hain aapke jo bhi parents hote hain do you think that they grip for anything no because agar aapki soft skills achhi hai that can be that can become your usp uh, usp aapko pata hai kya hota hai usp uh, kabhi aapne television shows dekha hai jab bolte hain big boss bhi dekha hoga bahut sare shows dekhe honge aapne to kuch kuch aise incidents hote hain to log bolte hain ye trp usp badhane ke liye kar rahe hain right so just to make you famous for that so how you know everybody wants to make themselves famous right so how you can become famous how you want to be you know everybody wants to be different from other people हाँ मुझे भी ऐसा लगता है कि मैं सबसे डिफरेंट होनी चाहिए मैं सबसे अलग होनी चाहिए इन माई थॉट इन माई प्रोफेशन लाइक दैट बट हाउ कैन यू वर्क ऑन दैट किस तरह से हम अलग दिखें किस तरह से हमारी अलग पहचान बने सोसाइटी में वो ऐसे ही बन सकती है जब हम अपनी सॉफ्ट स्किल्स हमारे बोलने के तरीके में हम बदलाव लाएंगे ओके इफ वी 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 टॉक वेरी नाइसली टू पीपल इफ वी लीव इन इम्प्रेशन राइट आपने भी अपनी लाइफ में एक्सपीरियंस किया होगा कि uh, किसी से आप मिले हैं ना आपने बाद में उस इंसान के जाने के बाद आपने बहुत तारीफ सुनी होगी उसकी कि ये बहुत अच्छा इंसान था या बहुत अच्छे इंसान है अभी uh, जिसने बहुत अच्छे से बात करी दैट दैट मीन्स यू नो द वे यू स्पीक रियली मैटर्स ओके 
that leaves an impression to uh, the other person okay so this is the basic difference between hard skills and soft skills okay so hard skills uh, you know you can require definitely you can require but to uh, make, you know get a good job to maintain a good relationship with people socially okay professionally you need soft skills okay all right some common soft skills are uh, on your screen that is communication skills this is uh, common soft skills leadership skills your work work ethics uh, creative problem solving i'll explain you each uh, soft skill but first i'll pick creative problem solving so uh, you know creative problem solving what is uh, i mean uh, creative problem solving is suppose you have a problem you are working somewhere or you are a student also okay you have a problem aapko koi problem ho gayi hai aur ab aap bahut zyada tensed ho aur bahut zyada pareshan ho us cheez ko leke right and you are saying this to your friends your relatives your preparents your professor that this is the problem oh my god ab main kya karu ya main kya kar sakta hu is situation mein so hum logo ka ye tendency hoti hai ki jab bhi hamare paas koi problem aati hai हम बहुत टेंस हो जाते हैं एंड वी ट्राई टू यू नो कम्युनिकेट आर प्रॉब्लम टू सो मेनी पीपल बट यू नो हैव यू एवर रियलाइज कि कोई इंसान इतनी जल्दी मदद नहीं कर सकता है हमारी हमारी खुद की मदद हमें खुद को करनी होती है राइट पीपल आर वेरी मच ईगर टू लिसन यू कि अरे अरे तुम्हें प्रॉब्लम है क्या प्रॉब्लम हो गई ओह हो ओके नो बट विल नॉट गिव यू अ वेरी Uh, you know, very comfortable solving or very very nice suggestion to you. No, they'll not give you. They'll just eager to listen you. They are very curious about your problems. लोग आपकी problem सुनना चाहते हैं पर solve नहीं करना चाहते हैं. आपकी problem है आपको solve करनी पड़ेगी. Don't be dependent on anybody, right? So creative solve problem solving. If I'll give you example of corporates, I'm pretty much sure that you know most of you. Uh, will definitely move out from your city to uh, attain something in life to to do something good for yourself and for your career right so if you go out and uh, i'll give you an example of corporates in corporates people used to say or your boss or your immediate manager used to say that aap apni problems ke sath mat aao come with solution also right aap jab job karoge लोग ऐसे लोगों को पसंद करते हैं जो प्रॉब्लम तो होती है लेकिन प्रॉब्लम के साथ में दो तीन सजेशन दे दैट दिस इज द प्रॉब्लम सर और मैम एंड आई हैव टू थ्री सोल्यूशन फॉर दिस सो फॉर विच सोल्यूशन वी कैन गो राइट सो दिस इज ऑल अबाउट क्रिएटिव प्रॉब्लम सॉल्विंग हाउ यू आर टेकिंग प्रॉब्लम इन अ पॉजिटिव वे इट इज योर प्रॉब्लम और प्रॉब्लम को सॉल्व भी आपको ही करना है नो बट इज गोइंग टू सॉल्व योर प्रॉब्लम so be prepared for that come with solutions not only with problems because jo log crip karte hain jo log hamesha pareshan rehte hain log unhe kam pasand karte hain jo log hamesha solve karte hain aap apne friend circle ka example lijiye aapko koi problem hai aap i'm pretty much sure aap hamesha un doston se apni problem share karna chahte hain jo aapko suggestions sahi dete hain right aap kabhi bhi sabhi friends ke sath aapki problem discuss nahi karte hain so why why it happens because you know that the person will definitely give you a proper solution for your problem but why to reach out people for uh, to discuss your own problem right so just uh, be positive in every situation even if the situation is negative for you right now we'll talk about communication skills I, as i told you earlier also that communication skills is an art and you have to learn that and you have to practice on daily basis and the other thing is leadership so definitely i ask my students uh, you know uh, what you want to become you want to become a follower or you want to become a leader so everybody wants to be become a leader but how you can become a leader by initiating every time you have to initiate something from your side right hum kabhi bhi jaate hain aap log bhi apne trips pe jaate hoge college mein bahut kuch karte hoge aap so hamesha aapke professors kisi ek ko appoint kar dete honge that you are the leader of this group तो ऐसा क्यों होता है बिकॉज पास्ट एक्सपीरियंस में ऐसा रहा होगा कि द पर्सन यू नो उसने एग्जाम्पल दिया होगा उसने एग्जाम्पल सेट किया होगा कि आई आई कैन बी अ गुड लीडर सो ट्राई टू इनिशिएट थिंग्स आगे बढ़ बढ़ के आपको काम करना चाहिए दैट मीन्स दैट यू हैव गॉट लीडरशिप स्किल्स आपके प्रोफेशन में या किसी भी प्रोफेशन में लीडर्स कैसे बनते हैं कैसे हायर पोस्ट पे आते हैं जब लीडरशिप स्किल्स होती है आपके अंदर राइट right? 
time management is really very important in life right uh you know how you manage time we all have got 24 hours in a day and how you are going to manage this 24 hours 24 ghante sabko milte hain equal hai right pradhan mantri ko bhi 24 ghante milte hain hame bhi 24 ghante milte hain right so ab is 24 ghante mein we have to give time to our parents we have to give time to our family right we have to give our time to studies and uh, to work so many things some household work so like that but if you will waste time on one thing and you are doing one thing again and again and you are just giving time to any particular thing and you are not you are just ignoring all the things that means you are not able to manage your time properly so when i'll just give you one small tip here whenever you wake up in the morning right just decide few things for a day that aaj ke din mein mujhe kya kya kaam karna hai right and just finish that work by the end of the day and you will feel so good and relaxed that yes you know i have done something for me okay so you know this is all about soft skills you know these common soft skills and uh, team players you should be a team player and conflict resolution it is very much close to problem solving okay so conflict resolution person should be there okay so this these are some common soft skills okay now communication it just more than talking you know when we talk abhi main aapse communicate kar rahi hu right so main aapse communicate kar rahi hu to i'm using english language i'm using hindi language also right because i know i have to communicate okay so communication is just talking with people it is listening with presence okay if you are physically present but not mentally present that means you know it's just a waste of sitting in this webinar right so basically you should be a active listener so that you can grab things properly acche se sunna hai aapko tabhi aapko samajh mein aayega right it is uh, i think uh, can we mute everybody i'm getting some disturbance yes now it's fine it's creating personal connections okay you create personal connection you you become good with relationships okay you have to practice communication okay i'll tell you how you can do this thing okay stop getting nervous this is the only mantra for everything you should not be nervous even if you have such a big thing in in front of you and you have to do that and if you are doing it for the first time don't be nervous you have to do it there is no option okay so you have to so why not uh, we we smile and we accept the thing and we do it in uh, in a positive way without getting nervous right so the next point is in a communication 55% is your body language okay suppose uh, i'll give you an example aap ka kahi pe interview hai right and uh, interviewer pa- interviewers and or your panel is waiting for you and your turn has come theek hai aapka turn aa gaya hai ab aap interview wale room mein enter bhi hone wale ho right so when you enter in your uh, interview room you will be judged on your body language first okay the way you are walking the way you are asking to sit to your interviewer okay so 55% is your body language agar aap wahan pe nervous dikh gaye that means definitely you will uh, will you will not get good marks in your interview 38% is your tone okay? if you are speaking very slowly that is not acceptable if you are speaking very loud that is also not acceptable speak clearly very precisely and very nicely in a soft tone because we are talking about soft skills right so 38% is your tone and 7% are your words sometimes what happen हम लोग को बोलना बहुत होता है लेकिन हम लोग को वर्ड्स नहीं मिलते राइट वी वुड बी कुड फाइंड एन वर्ड असेंबल एंड जस्ट मेक अ सेंटेंस फॉर दैट राइट सो दीज ऑल आर द थिंग्स व्हिच रियली मैटर्स ओके एंड यू हैव टू टेक केयर ऑफ दैट ओके नाउ वी विल टॉक अबाउट हाउ टू क्रिएट गुड सॉफ्ट स्किल्स एंड कम्युनिकेशन इट्स वन एंड द सेम थिंग so it's really very important to smile okay aap kabhi bhi i'm not sure uh, how many of you have gone out of india but uh, in india you know sometimes what happen agar uh, 
हम स्माइल कर आप बाहर कभी भी जाएंगे तो वहां पे आपको कोई अननोन भी होगा ना इफ यू आर इन एनी मॉल और इफ यू आर इन एनी रेस्टोरेंट और इफ यू आर एनी एनी वेयर दे यूजली स्माइल ओके वो एक दूसरे को देख के स्माइल करते हैं वो ऐसा नहीं है कि वो जानते हैं एक दूसरे को बट वाई डू दे स्माइल बिकॉज इट जस्ट जस्ट स्वीट जेस्टर फॉर समबडी आफ्टर ऑल वी ऑल आर ह्यूमन बींग वेदर वी नो इच अदर और नॉट बट वी शुड ऑलवेज स्माइल बट हम इंडिया में ऐसा नहीं कर सकते राइट right? इंडिया में अगर हम किसी को जानते नहीं और हंस दें तो पक्का उस बंदे की पटाई है राइट सो वी के नॉट डू दिस थिंग बट ऑफकोर्स वी कैन इम्प्लीमेंट दिस थिंग इन आर प्रोफेशनल लाइफ इन आर डेली डे टू डे लाइफ ओके सो हम हंस सकते हैं तब राइट वी कैन गिव अ स्माइल ओके सो आपका इंटरव्यू है और अगर आप स्माइल के साथ एंटर होते हो इंटरव्यू रूम में तो डेफिनेटली यू विल टेक अ वन टेक ब्राउनी पॉइंट देयर ओनली ओके डोंट लुक नर्वस इवन इफ यू आर ऐसा हम कभी नहीं कह सकते हैं कि नर्वस मत हो ऐसा ऐसा नहीं हो सकता है कभी कभी नर्वस होते हैं यू लुक नर्वस एंड सो यू डोंट हैव टू कभी कभी हमें छुपाना चाहिए कुछ चीजों को राइट सो डोंट लुक नर्वस इवन इफ यू आर जस्ट कीप इट विद इन योर सेल्फ दैट येस सपोज आई एम नर्वस दैट यू नो शिल्पा यू आर नर्वस बट यू डोंट हैव टू टेल इट टू द वर्ल्ड राइट दुनिया को नहीं बताना ना हम नर्वस हैं हम खुश हैं हम दुखी हैं या जो भी है जस्ट कीप इट विद इन योर सेल्फ एंड मूव अहेड ओके दैट गिव यू स्ट्रेंथ एक्चुअली बॉडी लैंग्वेज एज आई डिस्कस्ड अर्लियर दैट रियली मैटर्स अलॉट यू नो एक्नोलेजमेंट आर रियली वेरी इंपॉर्टेंट राइट सपोज यू आर सिटिंग इन अ गैदरिंग यू शुड एक्नोलेज द पर्सन राइट सपोज आप सेशन में बैठे हो आप बातें कर रहे हो या मोबाइल आप कुछ यूज कर रहे हो राइट right? that means you are not taking interest in the person who is speaking in front of you right that's really very important to acknowledge the beholder okay hamesha aapko calm and approachable dikhna hai right look calm look smart okay and approachable now uh, this is this point is really very important i am going i am highlighting it with my uh, cursor this is digital etiquette that is mobile devices you know these days you know students are addicted and in fact we are also addicted to our mobile everything is there in in in, in this small uh, piece you know you can say a small device so we have to check our emails we have to check our whatsapp group messages or other messages we have to take calls and so many other things so we are so much dependent on mobile services mobiles and um, we are so much into digital thing now there are so many types of etiquettes you know email etiquettes are there digital etiquettes are there table etiquettes are there okay how you walk how you talk so this digital etiquette is really very important okay aap ghar pe baithe hote hoge aapki mummy ne pretty much sure bahut bar aapko toka hoga please switch off your mobile ye mobile hatao khana khana hai ye mobile hatao baatein kar rahe hai na abhi hum sab right it happens right so digital etiquette must be there you should know when to use your mobile when to use your laptop when to use any digital thing okay you should understand this thing okay so this all comes in digital etiquette you know suppose you are sitting in a hospital okay you are you are sitting in a waiting area over there and you are just started watching some videos over youtube your whatsapp videos or like that and you are you are on loud speaker do you think it looks nice no of course not so you should understand this thing and uh, what to say matters but how to say matters more right aap kabhi bhi apne aapke brother sister honge right kabhi aisa hota hoga ki आपकी बात पेरेंट्स नहीं मानते होंगे लेकिन आपके ब्रदर सिस्टर की बात मानते होंगे ऐसा क्यों और फिर अगर आपको कोई चीज करवानी है देन आप क्या बोलोगे कि प्लीज ब्रदर पेरेंट्स से बोलो ना दैट आई वांट दिस थिंग राइट हाउ बिकॉज आपके भाई को या आपके बहन को पता है किस तरह बात करनी है पेरेंट्स से इफ यू रियली वॉन्ट समथिंग राइट बट यू डोंट नो हाउ टू से सो यू नो वॉट टू से बट यू डोंट नो हाउ टू से सो हाउ इट इज गोइंग टू वर्क राइट सो पता होना चाहिए कि कैसे बोलना है राइट अगर आपको छुट्टी लेनी है किसी किसी दिन तो आपको बोलना होगा क्लियरली दैट आई वॉन्ट लीव ऑन दिस डे बिकॉज ऑफ दिस रीजन ओके बोलना आना चाहिए ओके सो वी ऑल्सो नीड टू प्रैक्टिस पॉज टाइम एंड साइलेंस ओके 
pause time silence these are really very important it's not always necessary that you have to talk just to prove your existence this is not right okay just you know uh, think when i can speak okay suppose you are sitting you if if i'll give you example of gd right so in gd pis you know people usually get confused in gd that you know they think the gd is a you know ye bahut behas ka hai no you can also prove your point but the other person also has a right to prove their point right so basically you have to understand where when to get silence okay when to get when to pause in any conversation like that okay aapko ye samajhna hoga now the last point uh, in this slide that is campus to cooperate now campus to cooperate okay now campus you are in campus and life from campus to corporate what do you think i know you cannot speak it is like you know you'll speak at the last of uh, the session but yes campus to corporate this is you know very important time for you all bahut important time hai abhi aap aap campus se leke corporate tak that means campus se leke aapke job life tak jab tak aap nahi pahunchte ho you have to work on so many things bahut sari cheezon pe aapko kaam karna hai right you as i told you earlier that you know i hail from rajasthan okay and i know uh, the culture of uh, so many things here right if you talk about study if you talk about so many other things right but when you go out your competition gets higher you meet so many types of people of different culture different states and you have to match with them right so in my college also there are so many students who are like from approximately 22 to 24 states so students they they talk to each other they exchange each other's culture so how do they do this thing because they they have got good communication skills no first of all you have to communicate in and you have to get comfortable in the situation right so campus to cooperate jab tak aap college mein hai and college ke baad aapka jab tak job nahi lagta hai this is a very crucial time for you all aapko bahut mehnat karni hai aapki padhai pe bahut mehnat karni hai aap kis tarah se present karte ho us pe bahut mehnat karni hai and how you are going to do things for your own is pe aapko mehnat karni hai right now even if you have good uh, scored good marks in your college but if you are shy and not comfortable in talking to a lot of people or large gathering in that case your marks become secondary because you are practically weak okay hum log kehte hain na kitabi keeda hai kitabi keeda banne se kisi ka koi bhala nahi hua hai until unless if you don't have any practical knowledge right so you have to get in feels and you have to understand you know what kind of nature people have and what their what are their tendency right so basically you should make yourself practically strong okay soft skills cannot be measured but can be proved okay you can prove that you are good communicator you can prove that you are a nice person your soft skills cannot be measured your uh, soft skills can be proved okay the soft skills helps in building relationships creating opportunity and good for your own reputation right suppose i'll give you an example aap doctor ke paas jaate ho okay agar ek doctor hai jo bahut rudely aapse baat karta hai and ek doctor hai jo bahut nicely aapko calm down karta hai and aapko bolta hai aap theek ho jaoge jaldi se don't worry about that definitely you will go to and you will approach that doctor only even if you'll get appointment after 3 days or 1 week you will definitely go to that doctor only okay because aadhi bimari to acche se baat karne se hi theek ho jati hai aur ek doctor hai wo aapko bole ki ki kya hai ye hai aap dhyan nahi rakhte ho aap medicines nahi lete hoge ya whatever it is you know that uh, i'm not going to do this thing or whatever it is so basically people get attracted to those people who are nice to you who talk to you very uh, uh, positively and who are very genuine and very good with you right so you approach that only soft skills okay soft skills uh, helps in building relationship definitely agar aap ye achhi soft skills hai aap acche rishte bana sakte ho sabhi se right hum bhi dekhte hain hamare parents hain unke parents ke time ke bahut sare aise jewelers hote hain bahut sare aise log hote hain jo unke time se hamare ghar pe kaam karne aa rahe hote hain because why because of their good relationship 
उनकी अच्छी बात से अच्छे बिहेवियर से ही वो अट्रैक्ट होते हैं राइट ओके हार्ड स्किल्स गेट एन यू एन इंटरव्यू बट सॉफ्ट स्किल्स गेट एन कीप द जॉब हाफ हार्ड स्किल्स जो है वो डेफिनेटली आपको इंटरव्यू तक ले जाएंगी हम लोग सीवीज देखेंगे हम लोग रेज्यूमे देखेंगे हाँ ठीक है ये बच्चा टॉपर है इसको बुलाओ इंटरव्यू के लिए राइट तो इंटरव्यू तक तो आप पहुंच जाओगे बट इंटरव्यू के बाद आपको जॉब मिलेगा या नहीं मिलेगा वो आप जब बोलोगे तभी होगा ना हम हमारे बच्चों को यही कहते हैं यहाँ पे पुणे में कि इट्स आर ड्यूटी टू गेट कंपनीज इन द कॉलेज इट्स आर ड्यूटी टू ब्रिंग गुड कंपनीज राइट बट अल्टीमेटली हाउ यू आर गोइंग टू परफॉर्म इन दैट कंपनी और इन फ्रंट ऑफ योर इंटरव्यू दैट कंप्लीटली डिपेंड्स ऑन यू हाउ यू आर गोइंग टू ग्रैप द जॉब कैसे आपको जॉब मिल सकता है कैसे आप जॉब पा सकते हो वो आप पे डिपेंड करता है कंपनी हम ले आए लेकिन जॉब आपको मिलना है ना मिलना वो आपकी परफॉर्मेंस पे डिपेंड करेगा राइट सो नो मैटर वट पोजिशन वी आर वी ऑलवेज वर्क विथ पीपल एंड फॉर दैट वी नीड सॉफ्ट स्किल्स हम लोगों को अगर सपोज आप वर्क करते हो लॉ फॉर्म में किसी में और वहां पे बहुत लोग होते हैं लेकिन अगर आपके जो सीनियर्स हैं आपसे अच्छे से बात नहीं करेंगे वॉट डू यू थिंक आपको अच्छा लगेगा वहां पे आप किसी और लॉ फॉर्म में चले जाओगे आप कहीं और काम करने लगोगे यू डेफिनेटली लीव दैट प्लेस सो वाई बिकॉज द पर्सन इज नॉट टॉकिंग टू यू नाइसली एंड दिस इज स्पेशली फॉर हायर मैनेजमेंट ऑल्सो अगर कोई हायर पोस्ट जितनी हायर पोस्ट पे आप जाते जाओगे यू शुड यू शुड बी मोर पोलाइट मोर हम्बल बिकॉज यू नीड टू गेट वर्क डन फ्रॉम पीपल अंडर यू राइट आपके अंडर में जो भी लोग हैं उनसे आपको काम करवाना है सो यू हैव टू बी नाइस विद देम राइट देन ओनली दे डू वर्क फॉर यू अदरवाइज नो बडी टेक्स योर यू नो रूड लैंग्वेज टूवर्ड्स यू राइट सॉफ्ट स्किल्स कैन बी लर्न इट कैन बी लर्न इट कैन बी प्रैक्टिस लाइक दैट ओके सो दिस इज ऑल अबाउट फ्रॉम माई साइड एंड यू नो You know there are a lot of things to talk about this topic because you know this is my forty and I'm always so happy to talk on such topics. Okay, so uh, this is from uh, my side and uh, all right. Uh, if you have any questions, you can ask me. कुछ क्वेश्चंस हैं आपके मन में तो आप पूछ सकते हैं राहुल सर और सुभाष सर आर दे अलाउड टू आस्क क्वेश्चन दे कैन अनम्यूट योर सर Uh, am I audible or not? Okay. Is there any question? मैम पुलकित गौर ने आपको कमेंट में किया है मैसेज क्वेश्चन किया है ओके आई विल जस्ट चेक ओके हाउ पुलकित गौर ओके हाय पुलकित So your question is, ma'am, how to look different or present in audience? Yes, for that you need a good uh, public skills, public speaking skills. Pull it. Your public uh, uh, speaking skills, which are very good, should be very good. And that you have to do confidence building exercise. Right? So basically, you have to build confidence. Okay? You you have to do something that you know that impresses somebody. right so first of all you have to uh, you know eradicate or you have to erase uh, nervousness okay nervous nahi hona hai aapko all right and uh, first you know i'll give one tip 
for you know to everybody because you know this question is very good because you know how we can look different and uh, how we can present ourselves in audience in large gatherings so uh, first of all in this covid 19 situation as you can see that uh, physical classes are not there so we are very much dependent on technology and we are dependent on such things right so basically just start to improving your reading skills read something on daily basis okay i am not saying that read some course books read whatever you like in english okay so, and uh, you uh, start watching some uh, hollywood movies as well with some subtitles that will definitely improve your speaking skills okay and if you really want to become different right suppose aapko ek chance milta hai sabke samne bolne ka right you get a chance to speak in so many in front of so many people aap kis tarah se different feel karaoge kaise feel karaoge because sabse pehle aapko kuch ek acha quotation hona chahiye dimag mein right and just start with a positive note right as i told you that if you are nervous you don't have to tell the public that you are nervous okay that should be keep in ourselves so basically uh, you can look different by your own skills okay you can you have to work on your skills and uh, this is uh, all about this question any other question i can see only one question uh only one question is there okay riddhi how to under which one do you prefer by team work or working alone yes team work is always good because you you need people to work okay so it depends on your work also suppose you have got a, a target okay and you have your your work is very very big you know you and you have less time definitely you will approach your colleagues right aap apne colleagues se bologe ki mujhe help ki zarurat hai because i have got this big work too okay but working alone you know always leaves you alone aapko alag alag agar aap kaam karoge na aapke team wale aapko nahi lenge team mein wo bolenge nahi akele kaam karta hai isko help ki bhi zarurat nahi hai aur ye support bhi nahi karta hai तो वो गलत इंप्रेशन हो जाएगा आपकी तरफ से राइट सो बेसिकली यू शुड ऑलवेज प्रिफर टीम वर्क एंड इट आल्सो डिपेंड्स एट व्हाट काइंड ऑफ वर्क यू आर डूइंग राइट सो टीम वर्क इज ऑलवेज गुड बिकॉज यू आर कनेक्टेड विद योर कलीग्स राइट दिव्यांशी चित्तौरा ओके कैन यू टेल मी अबाउट अ टाइम एंड थिंग्स डिट गो अकॉर्डिंग टू प्लान हाउ डिड यू को yes there are times divyanshi it's a good question it is related to psychology as well you know time when things didn't go according to plan you know plan jo hota hai na if i if i take example of corona virus right we were not planned but it just happened right and we were not prepared with this but now after itne sare mahino ke baad after couple of months we have accepted this thing that this is the new normal and you know jab tak vaccine nahi aati hai we have to live like this only by wearing mask by using sanitizers by taking all the best uh, you know uh, precautions we have to deal with the situation so if things didn't go according to the plan just have patience pause or silence as i discussed that point okay and just wait for the right time हम लोग सोचते हैं कि हमारी लाइफ में ही ऐसा क्यों होता है जब भी कोई प्रॉब्लम होती है तो हम परेशान हो जाते हैं कि हमारी लाइफ में ऐसा क्यों है प्रॉब्लम हमारी लाइफ में क्यों है नो no, ऐसा नहीं है बड़े बड़े लोगों की प्लानिंग फेल हो जाती है इफ यू टेक एग्जाम्पल ऑफ मिनिस्टर्स इफ यू टेक एग्जाम्पल ऑफ पॉलिटिशियन एनी 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 थिंग इफ यू टेक एग्जाम्पल ऑफ डॉक्टर्स समटाइम्स यू नो थिंग्स फेल और थिंग्स यू नो गेट चेंज और प्लान के हिसाब से काम नहीं हो पाता है जस्ट टेक लाइव एग्जाम्पल बहुत लोगों ने सोची होगी कि सोचा होगा कि इस साल शादी करेंगे हम लोग राइट बट शादी नहीं हो सकती है हो भी सकती है तो फिफ्टी पीपल आर इन्वाइटेड सो दिस वॉज नॉट प्लान ओके तो देअर प्लान गेट फेल्ड बट दे आर डूइंग दे आर रेडी टू डू दैट 
कुछ लोगों ने शादी करी है एंड दे फॉलो द न्यू नॉर्मल पचास लोगों को इन्वाइट किया है एंड दे आर हैप्पी सो इट डिपेंड्स ऑन दैट ओनली राइट हाउ मच यू आर पॉजिटिव ओके इफ थिंग्स आर गेटिंग नेगेटिव जस्ट टेक अ पॉज एंड वेट फॉर द राइट टाइम सो दैट यू कैन अगेन स्टार्ट वर्किंग ऑन योर प्लान फॉर विच यू आर वेटिंग ओके श्वेता दुबे ओके soft skills make person different from others but can it, can it go worse too yes of course it does because if you are you know if you are not ready to speak fluently if you are not confident enough that means it it, it get it get worse also as i told you earlier your communication is important language sometimes matters and sometimes not because obviously if you are working somewhere your language matters but communication is something that you have to communicate right hindi mein agar aapko communicate karna hai tab bhi kar sakte ho but communication matters okay but agar aap nervous ho jate ho aur agar aap kuch galat bolte ho that means it can leads to worse situation right shahid bashir okay ma'am i getting nervous in front of audience even after knowing everything how to get rid of and solutions basically uh, shahid you have to practice a lot आपको बहुत प्रैक्टिस करनी होगी इस चीज के लिए एंड एज एज आई टोल्ड यू ऐसा कुछ भी काम नहीं है वी ऑल आर ह्यूम एंड वी हैव वॉट सेम ब्रेन ऐसा कहते हैं ना उसके पास दिमाग ज्यादा है हमारे पास कम है ऐसा कुछ नहीं होता वी ऑल हैव वॉट गुड ब्रेन एंड सेम ब्रेन इट इट डिपेंड्स ऑन अस दैट हाउ वी कैन ब्रेन वॉश हाउ वी कैन वर्क ऑन ब्रेन यू नो किस तरह से हम काम कर सकते हैं हमारे ब्रेन पे हमारे ब्रेन की उतनी ही लिमिट है जितनी सबकी है so basically you should not get nervous okay nervousness hai emotionally aap week ko bahut ghabra rahe ho to aap nahi kar paoge kuch just even agar aap galat bhi bolte ho na that is acceptable speak wrong also that is acceptable but at least you are trying to speak okay so aapko ye practice ki bahut zarurat hai isme right Now, Siddharth Biswas. Sometimes soft skills are not helpful because some people never understand its value, and then what we should do? Yes, of course. Sometimes people think that you know, you know, we should know how to speak and when to speak, and people should always know their audience. Audience कैसी है आपको पता होना चाहिए, right? अगर मैं आपसे हिंदी में बात कर रही हूँ, मैं आपसे इंग्लिश में बात कर रही हूँ, because I want you all to be comfortable in this webinar, right? but at the very moment of time if i start speaking in german or some spanish language or start speaking or giving you some examples in spanish language or any other language that is not comfortable for you right so basically you know you have to understand this thing that even when you start speaking you should know your audience audience ko ne ye pata hona chahiye aapko right audience ko dekh ke aap usi hisab se baat kariye to aapko koi problem nahi hoga okay so all right megha how do we speak english fluently in front of anyone how can we practice yes very good question megha so first of all as i told you um, that you know you have to start reading okay and you know if you are talking about fluent english how you can speak fluent in english first of all you have to make your jaw flexible this is our jaw line right okay सो so, सपोज हम लोग हमारी जो हिंदी लैंग्वेज हम इतना अच्छे से क्यों बोल लेते हैं बिकॉज वी आर स्पीकिंग सिंस चाइल्ड हुड राइट दैट्स आर मदर टंग लैंग्वेज सो देर इज वन यू नो प्रॉब्लम और वन बैरियर इन फ्लूएंट इंग्लिश दैट इज यू नो मदर टंग इन्फ्लुएंस सो इफ इफ दैट इज दैट लैंग्वेज इज डोमिनेटिंग इन आर्ट्स राइट सो इफ यू स्टार्ट स्पीकिंग इन इंग्लिश ट्राई टू मेक स्मॉल स्मॉल सेंटेंसेस राइट and also sometimes we know how to speak and we know what to speak but sometimes we are not able to make any sentences because we are not good in vocab right so basically aapko apni vocabulary strong karni hogi try to write at least 10 new words okay nowadays you don't need any you know uh, hard copy of dictionary you all have got dictionary e dictionaries are there so you can find new words you can write on daily basis just try to just do one small exercise just write 10 words 
in a day and write their meaning also and try to make sentence of those words okay that will definitely help you and try to implement that sentence and try to implement all those exercises in your daily life right because abhi aap kar sakte ho abhi aap college mein ho college mein aapko correct karne wale bahut milenge aapke professors hain aapke friends hain right but aap once you leave college और फिर आप जब जॉब में आओगे वहां पे कंपटीशन होगा वहां पे लोग आपको ऊंचे नहीं उठाएंगे लोग आपको अगर आपकी वीकनेस है तो आपको नीचे उठा नीचे धकेलेंगे कि ये अच्छा नहीं है ठीक है जस्ट ऐसे कर दो इनके साथ नहीं ऐसा नहीं होना चाहिए राइट अम्बरीश हाउ यू अम्बरीश इज माई स्टूडेंट फ्रॉम पुणे सो यस अम्बरीश हाउ शुड वी गेट कॉन्फिडेंस ओके Amrish, you know, uh, we can get confidence by exercising so many things. Okay, talk in front of a mirror. Talk in front of your relatives. Okay, अपने किसी भी friend के साथ आप कोई कुछ भी आप ऐसा रख सकते हो Zoom meeting या कुछ and try to speak something on that. Pick any topic on which you are comfortable and start speaking in front of your parents, in front of your friends, cousins, brother, sister, anybody. Right. that will definitely uh, build good confidence right ishali sharma how how we act when someone disagree with our decision yes see you know uh, suppose if somebody is arguing with you ishali and uh, you are uh, not happy with the person's disagreement on your talk right so you don't have to react what you can say that i appreciate your point of view but i am somehow not you know not uh, comfortable with this thing you can say it very nicely that i respect your point of view but this is my point of view on this so you are accepting his disagreement also but at the very moment of time you are saying that you are also not wrong that's your point of view and everybody has got right to you know uh, express his or her point of view okay so you don't have to react just say that okay that's your point of view but my point of view on this is this right ashwini jain when have you performed a task without pre existing experience yes it it you know in life it happens that you you have to do so many things which you have never done in past okay or for which you don't have any experience right आप जॉब करोगे हर इंसान हर काम लाइफ में पहली बार जरूर करता है लेकिन पहली बार डर लगता है हम आपने मूवी देखी होगी ना मलंग मलंग में क्या डर लोगे कोई भी डर है वो दो या तीन बार आई डोंट रिमेम्बर द एग्जैक्ट डायलॉग्स बट वो क्या होता है कोई भी डर एक या दो या तीन बार आई डोंट रिमेम्बर लगता है राइट बट आफ्टर दैट यू बिकम हैबिचुअल ऑफ दैट यू बिकम कंफर्टेबल विद दैट सिचुएशन राइट एंड यू कैन गेट ऑल द टास्क इजी थ्रू ओके Bhomik Joshi, how to stay calm even after running, uh, running the first impression? Yes, you can stay calm. गलतियां सबसे हो सकती हैं. बड़े-बड़े लोगों से गलतियां होती हैं. हमने news देखी है. News में भी कभी-कभी वो लोग stammer कर जाते हैं, reporters डूबते हैं, या फिर कुछ गलत बोल जाते हैं. But they start from the very moment of time only. अगर उन्होंने कुछ गलत बोला है, तो just ignore that and वो आगे सही बोलने लग जाते हैं. अगर आपको क्योंकि वो आपको पता है ना आपने गलत बोला है सामने वाले को तो पता भी नहीं चलेगा कि आपने गलत बोला है अगर आप इमीजिएटली उसके बाद आप स्टार्ट कर देते हो कुछ बोलना राइट सो बेसिकली एज आई टोल्ड यू दैट पॉइंट दैट पॉज व्हेन टू पॉज एंड व्हेन नॉट टू पॉज सो इवन इफ यू स्पोक रॉन्ग जस्ट फोर एंड मूव ऑन डोंट लेट दूर ऑडियंस दैट यू सेट समथिंग रॉन्ग यू शुड बी स्मार्ट एनफ ओके so uh, how to stay calm even after running the first impression so it's not about that nobody ruins the first impression yes you have to prepare yourself for your first impression right but aisa kabhi nahi hota hai ki hamara first impression mein agar thodi si koi galti ho gayi to we have ruined for life it never happens okay galtiyan sabse hoti hain bade bade logon se hoti hai chote logon se bhi hoti hai so we are human beings and hum hi mistakes nahi karenge to kaun karega right so and we definitely learn from our mistakes so when you make mistakes aapko pata chal jayega ki maine ye mistake kari thi and you know that right and you will you will work on that and you stop doing that mistake again in future so you have to create your impression and at the very moment of time you have to learn from your mistakes also okay all right yes 
So uh, I have answered all the question and I can't see any more questions in chat box. So <clears throat> I think uh, uh, we can wind this up. So I, I'm going to hand over this to um, Rahul sir. Uh, yes, Professor Shilpa. Uh, yes, sir. Hello, sir. Thank you. Thank you very much for your valuable time. My pleasure, sir. And uh, it was really a nice deliberation, nice session. Thank you. I understand sir. that uh, the student, those who listen to you, might have gained and benefited out of what they have uh, heard, what they have listened from you. And uh, we expect same kind of gesture in future also because uh, you are the person you keep on taking webinars, seminars, and uh, workshops on soft skills and behavioral aspects. So I understand that always be benefited to the students, uh, whatever the field they are going to opt even in the future also. So thank you very much. You have really spent your valuable time, despite the fact that you are going to have another webinar and meeting after yes. a couple of minutes, still you continue till 12.32. It was really a nice gesture. Once again, from the bottom of my heart and uh, on behalf of Pacific School of Law, I accord a thank note and uh, uh, I understand that the students put up themselves in a very nice manner. Right? Thank, Thank you. you, sir. Thank you, sir. And uh, you know, I just want to end this with a with a note of uh, Robert's uh, Frost poem that you know, uh, woods are <laughs> lovely, dark and green. So you know, miles to go before I sleep. You know, Absolutely. so you know, learning cannot be stopped. You know, even I'm a professor, I'm a trainer, and uh, you know, it doesn't like that. You know, we learn at every point of our life, and we can learn it from our children, we can learn it from our students as well. You know, so learning is an endless process, and we have to keep learning, you know, at the old age also. So, this is all about from my side and trust yes, it's an ongoing process yes sir yes sir it's an ongoing process so this is all about it was really nice interacting with your students and i wish uh, to interact with you uh, with them all uh, uh, very soon again okay and whenever your students need me i'm always there thank you thank you thank you very much yes sir okay dear thank you yeah thank you okay, sir okay guys thank you thank you very much you, you all have you know. a nice day ahead. Good job. Thank you. Thank you. See you, See you sir. Shahid Bashir.